Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I appreciate you stopping by, and of course you, you got here just in time. That's right, just in time for us to go explore the smallest of Texas state parks. We're currently set up at South Llano River State Park, Junction, Texas. Love this park. You should come visit it. We're headed, we're headed up to Potter, Potter's Creek, the Corps of Engineer, on Canyon Lake. There is a Texas State Park that I have had a challenge in getting to because it's, it's there's no camping. It's actually the smallest Texas State Park. There's a big park. There's 16 acres of Texas State Park. That's right, just 16 acres. It's Old Tunnel State Park. And as, as we're on the title up here, that you knew that already. The big question is, and I'm, I'm pretty sure that I have the answer already, can we get Trudy Thunder pulling white lightning to Old Tunnel and get up there and back without any issue not sure yet not sure yappy is going to be down with it because we got to do some hill country farm to market road action so it may be that this video turns into i go to old tunnel in white lightning either way we're going to go, we'll see you at Old Tunnel State Park. What a drive that was. Old Tunnel State Park. <laughs> we take up the whole parking lot. They have a bigger parking lot across there, but it's closed. So we came up old at the OSR the old San Antonio Road. And there's actually a restaurant over that way. The one half mile nature trail. Old Tunnel State Park is the smallest Texas state park. It is 16 acres. There it is. 1913. A railroad. The residence. So this was like a co-op railroad. Fredericksburg to San Antonio. 920 foot tunnel beneath this hill increased the cost by 134,000. Five months of labor after <laughs> Wait a minute. Passenger trains enter the tunnel. Small rocks loosened by exhaust were removed from the track and the windows closed to keep out coal smoke. 1942. I thought it was, and you know, I, I thought it was closed down sooner than that. And I can appreciate them folks wanting a straighter route because driving the five miles up here, and it's five miles of really twisty windy road hmm mexican free tail free tail bats moved in as soon as it was shut down 25 check this out catches 25 to 37 tons of insects nightly Wow. Last night they came out at 713. Apparently they were hard to see. Okay, so the old tunnel must be underneath us. We'll go explore that after we go down there.
So while I'm strolling down here, Big Bend Ranch is actually the largest Texas state park. And it encompasses a, <laughs> a lot of space. I think it's actually bigger than uh, Big Bend National Park. Oh, raccoon or something letting us know we're not welcome here. So you have two viewing galleries, the upper one, which was where we were, and the lower one. I've never been here, so I'm not exactly sure where any of that stuff is. I've just read about it. So we're right above. Oh, we can even, we can even get down there and see. Okay, cool. I actually hear honeybees. It's a very distinctive. There must be a bee, bee colony nesting here somewhere. said there's a very distinctive smell the closer you get. Old cedar elm. Ooh, that's steep. You can see them flying in there too. Let's see if I I'm gonna see if I can zoom in on that. Alright, here's where I'm gonna do the zooming in. Maybe that's not bees I'm hearing. Maybe that's all the bats in there that I hear. Not sure how well that's gonna work out. It definitely sounds like honeybees to me though. Apparently the trail heads on down that way. We're not gonna go very much farther. I gotta, we gotta get on down the road to get to camp. Bat poo and lots of it. All right, I'm gonna head back uphill. Can you see? So I, I, I have identified the bees. They're in this cedar elm tree up here. Don't know what they're getting. They're harvesting something from the cedar elm. See what else they have here at Old Old Tunnel. Vault toilets. 
great place to have a snack. <laughs> what a view. So we came around that road. Most, most windy of Texas Hill Country roads. And once again, I got the the lecture. The lecture about taking the RV places it's not intended to go. <laughs> what does that mean? All right. Bat houses. Good thing. Good thing to have is a bat house. Okay. I think we're done. I'm not exactly sure where the other side of that tunnel is. I don't even know if there's a a platform over there. I'm gonna go take a look. So it would seem that there's not a way to get to the back end of the tunnel. That's a neat place. I should have just come up here in the truck. Would have made it a little easier. And I think I'm gonna close this out right here make this a standalone video for old tunnel state park wait till some cars go by we're done here old tunnel state park you've seen it all this is the official bat colony for the state of texas the bat is the official flying mammal for the state of texas I wonder how many how many flying mammals are there but anyway that's another question not for this video we're done hey if you found some information entertainment some kind of value click on that thumbs up if you've not already i'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button it's right down there click on the subscribe button that really helps with the youtube algorithm those of you who have been following along thank you so much i wouldn't i wouldn't have be looking at the bat colony if it wasn't for y'all that's a bat house right there and for those of you who have been following along thank you i wouldn't be here if it wasn't for y'all i appreciate that and for my patrons i'm most grateful thank you for your generosity you guys rock all right, y'all come back now, you hear?